All right, y'all. So this is the fit for today. Uh, straight up Adidas, literally down to the socks. Um, Apple Watch. I'm wearing my uh, Adidas fit. This stuff is actually working really well today. Uh, it's really hot. It's like it feels like it's 90, like 93, but I think it's like 89, 86. Uh, it's pretty much peak hot right now. It is currently 243. I'm about to go inside the park now, but uh, I will see you all inside. Today was a great day. I already got the footage that I needed to for Kings of Minions update. So I will talk to you all in just a little bit. In the park now. Uh, yeah, it's 88 degrees, feels like 95. Freaking crazy. Humidity is ridiculous. It literally feels like Texas. I swear ever since I've been to Texas, almost every day in Virginia feels like Texas heat. It's insane. Um, it, it does have some wind, so that's the only plus. It is windy out here. But uh, yeah, the coaster looks amazing. I will show that during today's vlog. Gonna head to Grizzly first, and then I'll probably eat at the end. I'm gonna try to stay hydrated because I'm already at like three miles for today. So we'll try to hit five by the end of the day. And uh, that's how we're gonna run today. So Grizzly first, then Twisted, and we're just gonna make our way around the park. First off, one train up in freaking the middle of damn July. How you got one train in the middle of July, even on a weekday? What are we doing, Kingsman? Please. And there was one person locking restraints. Like, how are we this short staff in the this late in the season? It's crazy. Anywho, the ride itself though, that thing was flying. I have not seen it run that fast in a minute. And obviously I haven't ridden in it over a month, but that thing was cooking. Uh, very intrigued to see how twisted it is. So that's gonna be next. After that, I may ride Rebel Yell Race 75 and then make my way down to uh, Jungle X. Then I'm probably gonna leave because I was already here earlier. So I don't need to, I rode Dominator already. I'm already getting winded. I gotta get some more water, it's crazy. That was hands down. What's today's date? July 29th, 2024. Green train. Do let me only go straight to the green. Let me tell y'all something. In 90 degree heat, that was the fastest ride I've ever had on Twisted Timbers. Green train is just something there. That thing was relentless. That's the most aggressive I've ever seen that ride. Just, oh my gosh. Like, I wanna ride again. I just, I can't, they're ops. I can't, I can't do it y'all. The ops are too slow. But we're gonna make our way back down to uh, Intimidator and uh, Backlot and then Flight of Fear. And I'll probably close out my day like that. Why is Apple Zapple's speaker so loud? Like, it's so loud. Anywho, Flight of Fear, Intimidator, Backlot, knock those out. I will show you all uh, part of what the coastal looks like in that area now. Uh, but yeah, overall, a solid day. I'm, ro I'm rolling through it. I'm rolling through it. I'm about to be at five miles. I'm, I think I just hit four miles actually. So I'm just going to try to get five miles. And then after that, I'm dipping out spark. So yeah. Congratulations to Backlot. We all had the best operations of today, at least so far. I already know when I go to Intimidator, it's gonna be a bunch of BS because every time I go to Intimidator, they, it's like a four minute operation. I don't understand. Um, and y'all know, I'm gonna always complain about operations. It don't matter if a park has 10 minute 
five minute, three minute operations, there's no reason for that. Like, I understand if they have like a green card or disability pass or, you know, somebody doesn't fit, but like that's, you shouldn't have a four minute operation every single cycle that, especially when the park's not packed. Uh, thank you all for having three trains on backlot on top of that. So really nice they had three trains. I'm gonna ride Intimidator, maybe Flight of Fear. I don't know if I wanna deal with Flight of Fear's rattle. Um, that ride's honestly getting rough. But I will show you all uh, the new coaster. I'll show you all the construction for that in just a little bit, so yeah. the new view we got a coaster in the background now so as you saw they're actually working over there i still don't know what that area is if that's supposed to be a service road that they're creating for the coaster or what but yeah they also have that new you can also see the coaster behind us now uh, you can literally see it in the little top left, top right, whatever it is. Really dope to see that new skyline appearing uh, from around areas around the park. So I'm gonna hit back row again. Y'all, <laughs> I don't know what's going on today. It's a miracle at King's Million because I've gotten not one, not two, but three Dagwon rides. This guy gave me so much room, so much room on the seat. I, <laughs> let me explain to y'all, hold on. Let me get in some light really quick. I gotta explain this to y'all. You're not gonna believe it. So, basically, I've always wanted to experience this. The airtime on this ride, I was able to actually get the airtime I've always wanted. Dude let me go, he like literally like, just he kind of pulled down the restraint a little bit and he let me have all that room. So like, you could have fit another me inside that seat. When I tell you, I went down that drop, that ride was better than Fury. I mean, like, not only was the ride over in like a blink of an eye, there it goes right now, but yo, the third, that last ride that I just got, that, that ride, that made that better than Fury for me. That's how good it was. Like, first of all, it's going probably like 94 right now. Really, really, it's hauling, it's hauling. With this ride, the force from the drop will actually tighten down the strength. So because I'm, I kind of got some muscle, I was able to actually hold the restraint up from it like pulling down or going down. And uh, the air time that I got from that second hill, that was, whew, I wish you all could experience that. Like that's one of those things where like, I'm really glad that I am skinny because you probably won't be able to do that if like you're a larger size, like seriously, you're not gonna be able to do what I just did. But if you can try to, I don't know who that ride up is, but thank you so much. Also, shout out to the operations, the operations. I can't believe I'm saying it. They had like two minute ops. I can't believe it. It was literally a two minute off. Like you can't get much better than that. This day has gone great. Been a great day. I'm going to go ahead and show you all the new coaster 2025 launch wing coaster coming up. And uh, after that, I'm getting out of this park as hot as I'll get out. And I will talk to you all soon. Also, I saw a couple of baddies here too, but yeah. All right. All right, y'all. So that's what the new area looks like. This is crazy. You can literally see the inversion from here. Where that second inversion is going to be at. That's wild. 
That's crazy, man. All right, y'all. There was one last thing I forgot to show y'all before I end this vlog. Uh, delirium. So I'm gonna try to do this quick because they got new restraints on some parts of them. I'm not about to get copyright for this music, so I'll just show y'all. have to run into that issue at all like this park it, it was it wasn't packed but it was packed enough to be like all right there's no reason for us not to have two trains on you know what i mean really glad i got to see all the construction that was going on it was just awesome seeing that inversion and when i rode reptilian uh seeing it from the aerial view was just just awesome because that second inversion you're gonna go pretty much into an inversion and you're gonna hit some serious g-force going out of that inversion it's gonna be really awesome uh i'm looking forward to see what else happens with the ride i'm looking forward to see what the name officially is i'll give it that kings of man did a great job this year at hiding the name hopefully they didn't release the name tomorrow but to press because usually they try to release it to press a little bit faster uh or earlier than when they announce it but i think they're just gonna announce it online i don't think there's a real announcement uh at the park so i don't see a reason for me to go to the park and i probably won't be able to make it anyway because it's on a wednesday <laughs> I'm so glad I caught that. Like, y'all don't understand. I almost messed that up. I saw the wind blowing this way, and I kid you not, I literally caught it just in time. <laughs> but yeah, today was a great day. The wind does feel really good right now. Like I said, I, I was pretty, I was hot, but I gotta say, Adidas, shout out to Adidas. So whenever y'all want to sponsor me, I'm ready. I'm waiting for y'all. But yeah, that's gonna do today's vlog. Let me know uh, what y'all want to see next in the next video i don't know where i'm gonna go next i really want to go to dollywood i need to go to carowinds i need to go to king's island again i really don't want to go to king's island again because the visit that i had just was mid that park to me is just so mid there's just nothing out there for me thank you all for watching don't forget to like share subscribe until next time peace out let's go